Yeah, we were just really cautious with, with Josh. Um, Brandon uh, had a uh, pretty large contusion to his left hand. Uh, we got an x-ray, it was negative. Uh, and then it was just a matter of controlling the swelling. And, uh, you know, he was able to, you know, feel like he could get back in there. Um, we, we did have one play under center that we would like to have taken back because it was difficult for him to grip the ball from under center. But uh, again, uh, Josh was, was really being conservative. He was not ruled out of the game other than him not just feeling right. He had a busy week. You know, he made all those hats by himself this week. <laughs> <laughs> Stayed up late. Uh, you know, he had a busy week with exams. Uh, he was a bit run down this week. He wasn't feeling himself. Um, and, and so we were really, really conservative with him in terms of not putting him in the game. But he wasn't in our concussion protocol. We didn't, you know, have to move him through him with a head injury per se. So, um, you know, hopefully he's feeling a little bit better tomorrow with some rest. Where did he get nicked up then? Was it his back or? No, uh, oh, I'm nothing. saying he okay. just wasn't, he wasn't feeling right. Yeah. He, you know, he worked out on the sideline. He, 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 just, he just didn't feel good. And we're not gonna put anybody in the game if, if they don't feel, our, our, you know, Dr. Leisler is, is evaluating players, not necessarily on head injuries uh, or how they feel, but it's about balance, uh, coordination, uh, can they protect themselves the right way? Uh, and he just didn't feel, he didn't feel 100%. We're not gonna put somebody in the game if he just doesn't feel 100%. So sometimes it doesn't even have to do with a head injury. Uh, lots of points in this game. Yes, you know, school record yards until you kneel down. Yeah, those don't count. I don't know why people, you guys continuously add that. Can we just change that right now? <laughs> but silly. But from a defensive standpoint, was this part of what you were talking about in terms of not being a hundred percent focused? Do you feel like that's why maybe their points were up? Well, I, I think I think what I'm saying is, you know, two things. Wake Forest executed their offense. Terrifically. I mean, they were really, really good tonight. And then secondly, you saw missed tackles that you haven't seen all year. You, you saw some play that hadn't shown itself uh, at times. And, and that's not who we are 75% through this season. So let's go back and look at how we can improve on that. So uh, I think it's fair to say that Wake Forest played very well and Notre Dame uh, needs to uh, you know, obviously understand how hard this game is if, if you're not locked into all the tricks necessary to play at a high level. Coach, over here to the right.